All right, hello my friends. Welcome back to Shenanigans. Three, two, one. Um, today we're gonna do another Timu haul, but before I even get started, I'm gonna vent a little bit, so fast forward if you are just here for the products. I'll get through it. Um, really don't even know, for some reason, I'm already choking up uh, with what I'm gonna get into, but with that being said, go grab yourself a drink and some snacks. Um, it's going to be a relatively long haul. I'm going to try to keep my therapeutic communications down to a minimum, but uh, it's been a very uh, difficult week for me in regards to work-related. For those of you that are new here, I am a 51-year-old flight attendant, and a lot of times I will share um, a lot of my career details um, outside of just Timu hauls, and I need to vent. I need to emotionally vomit on you all, so make sure you got your gag bag, because uh, that's what I'm about to do. So if you've been following me for a little while, you know I always talk about like how flight attendants are considered sky waitresses and we just serve like drinks and whatever and I'm always like, oh, there's so much more to our job description than that. Um, and you guys see the news. You see like emergency landings and planes are on fire and things like that. And you know, I'm going to bounce all over the place, but I'm going to start with my shirt. It was $10.98. Shannon, shenanigans, double rolls, kind of exposing. Got my girdle on, but I'm loving this. I love the jersey uh, type shirts, and that's what I'm rocking for you today. Okay. Real deal. I got home late last night after um, I was working a trip from Ontario, California to San Francisco. Uh, you might have seen it on the news, but I was the flight attendant on that flight. And uh, long story short, I had a passenger that I thought was sleeping because I'm the aft back flight attendant. I'm sitting in my jump seat. And some people can sleep like this, not me, but I noticed the passenger was like this. And peripheral vision, I look at him again, and he slumps over. Lo and behold, this man went into a full-blown stroke and uh, jumped up. I don't want to get into it too much because I'm pretty messed up over the whole ordeal, but uh, I used to be a paramedic. Had my first uh, dry run after all that schooling. It was a DOA dead on arrival on Christmas Eve. It messed me up emotionally, and I realized I'm farly too emotional to be in this field of work, to be an emergency first responder. But uh, anyway, guys gurgling, doing CPR, shocked him with the paddles. He's like jumping, and uh, it's pretty traumatizing it. Me up, okay? So... Uh, I had one more trip to get back home to my base in Salt Lake City, and I said, I'm not fit for duty. Like, how am I going to serve you a Coca-Cola when I'm like this? Like, I'm going to spill it over both of us. So I ended up uh, getting a replacement for that trip, but it, it's been a rough week. So I'm going to start with that, number one. Number two, I'm under the weather. I am sick. I got that whatever. I guess it's going around all over from what I understand, but... The sinus infection, never had an earache in my whole life. I couldn't hear for two hours straight when we landed. Yeah, air pressure, your your ears will pop. But yeah, your girl is in rough shape physically and emotionally. But I thought maybe a good dis distraction, uh, me doing what I do, is a team at home. That being said, thank you so much for being here. I have uh, some new subscribers, and I would love to identify and call you out personally, but I'm not in the right frame of mind that I normally am, so thank you for being here. I love you guys. Um, we're going to get into it. If you are not familiar with Timu, let's get to that side of it. It is a online marketplace where you can shop like a billionaire. That is their slogan. 
I found it to be extremely true. Uh, I am a shopaholic. My source of therapy, you guys already know I, your girl, I got my Chardonnay right here. I'm not gonna pretend it's lemonade. I like my wine. Do you boo? I'll do me. No judgment here. Hopefully, well, you're gonna find judgment in the comments, but we're good with that. So, might be a little off on this uh, video, but I'm gonna get into it because this is what I love to do and I love you guys, so. Timu! Again, if you have not subscribed already, wait, wait until after the video if you'd like me to do so. If you don't, it's okay. Thank you for being here, giving me whatever time you give me. I'm going to get to the first product right away. It's a Christmas tree ornament. Yes, I took my tree down and everything, but I really saw this and loved it. I paid $2.19 for it and arrived broken. Hence why it's separated from the haul. I did go through and price everything. You're going to hear some crinkling. I probably will not get through the whole haul because I had 68 items in this. And I value your time, but I will try to spend enough time on each product so you can get an honest review. Um, I don't link descriptions, but if you like something that I'm hauling, if I'm hauling a bathroom rug, search bar bathroom rug, you'll see a whole It'll take some time because they've got any and everything you'll see it in there. Find the one that I'm hauling. Compare prices. Hopefully you find it. Anyway, Christmas tree ornament. So I'm going to take a little bit more time than I normally do to discuss the products and why I purchased them. This one, I've been with uh, my fiance, Jay, for my newbies for eight years. Common law marriage, yeah, he's my husband. We're engaged, not setting a date, not ready for all that yet. Just life is chaotic. Titles are not as important to me, but we met online. So um, I was married for 20 years, as was he. We both had infidelity from our partners. We're both pretty jaded. Like I come with baggage, obviously flight attendant baggage. So I, I just kind of like put my feelers out there and there was this Facebook dating site, I guess you could say called Zeus. And um, I went and it's supposed to be like local singles. Again, at the time I was living in Las Vegas, he was a two hour drive away in St. George, Utah. And I was like, all right, I'll just like kind of shop around. Like I still got it. I, you know, I was married for 20 years, three kids, but I'm still alive. And, uh, Started liking profile. Yeah, you're my type. Clean cut, shaven, athletic. Yes. Okay, here's me, the porky pile, whatever. Um, anywho, I liked his profile picture and Jay liked mine. And then we go to exchange like messages, text messages, and they wanted to charge us. And I'm like, Live in Las Vegas, options are not really that slim. I'm not going to spend money to meet somebody. This is what my frame of mind was at that point in time. So I was like, whatever. So I thought I'd be creative. I changed my description in the profile and said, hey, if you like what you see, I'm on social media. You can find me on the Facebook under Shannon Dill is in pickle, I-N-G. Give me a call, ing, ing, ing. Three months pass by, completely forget about this dude, and I get a message that says, hey, you're really creative and smart. I like what you did. And I'm looking at the profile picture, and I'm kind of like, why do I know this face? Well, it turned out he was like my favorite, a like on the profile, never corresponded, but I uh, sent me a message on Facebook, started talking for about three months, video chatting, whatever, and uh, lo and behold, here we are eight years later. That's the story. I'm sticking with it. So I saw this ornament. Glasses on off. And it arrived broken. So you know I'm going to send it back. But. I mean yeah. Of course I could hot glue it. But it says. You are the best thing I have ever found on the internet. And that says a lot. Because obviously internet shopping. Sheen. Amazon. Timu. It has a little red ribbon to hang it up with. Yes, I can hot glue it in the back, and you would never know. But, I mean, for what I say it was, $2.19, I'll probably, it's a lot more work for me to send a message. Hey, I need a replacement of a ride broken. I'll probably hot glue it. Because, you know what, when it's on the tree, 
with all the other ornaments. Are you really going to see it? Maybe. We shall see. Anyway, I hope you guys are doing fabulous. Just going to go through all this. Now, a lot of these products you're going to see today are Valentine's Day. So I have gotten into this kick where I'm trying to decorate the house accordingly. We don't entertain a lot. It's more for me, like, because I'm not home that often. So when I am here, I want to feel like I didn't miss Christmas or Easter or Valentine's Day. This was $5.59. And you've got your just little block. And a lot of these are gifts for him. He gets my Aquarius man. He He's pretty sensitive and emotional. I love and hate that about him at the same time. Because a lot of times, what are little bickers and arguments? And I'm like, dude, you're like... <laughs> So, like, reading into it, it's not that deep. Oh, we had an argument. It's great. We're good. But he'll want to dissect it and talk about it for hours. But what he does love is little messages like this. So it is concealed in the plastic bag. It says, I can't say I love you enough. So this is your reminder. And again, because I'm not home that much. And it's a gift for him, so I don't want to take it out. But that's what it says. So when I go to work one day and... Uh, he works nights, and a lot of times I have to leave at like 4 o'clock in the morning for my shift. I'll just leave that on the nightstand. And he'll call me and say, I love that, honey. Or I'll come home and it's still up. I can't say I love you enough, so this is your reminder. You know what I'm like? Like, I wrote a lot of letters in high school to the point where I got in trouble. <laughs> but, um... Sometimes, like, the smallest, smallest tokens like that, I, I don't know, for me, know your love languages, like, that's mine, is just, like, words of affirmation is, like, my top love language. Just say, hey, good job. I appreciate you, like, shoveling out the snow in the driveway, you know? Like, it's, I don't know, for me, it's a little things. I do apologize for my continued and loyal friends and subscribers. You'll already know I'm off. A little bit off. Next product. So I have this big vase. Um, and I try to fill it with the colors according to the holidays. Easter, lilacs, and yellows. Halloween, orange, and black. Christmas, green, and red. I got these little, like, um, twine balls. This I think there's 12, 12 of them, and it was $3.99. Again, I'm not going to take everything out of the packaging. I have this base, and it has, like, seashells and feathers, and, like, if we go to St. Lucia or wherever we're at, I will get a shell off the beach and kind of put it in there and Sharpie on the back, St. Lucia 2016. Or but the color reels... Um, kind of add just a little touch of decor for me. I thought they were going to be bigger. It's all right. It's okay. So we got the red and black and white for Valentine's Day. Again, it's a Valentine's Day haul. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. Next product was $4.28. If you've seen my previous haul, you know that I already got two of these. I've got a really big one in the kitchen that is running from the one counter past the dishwasher in front of the sink. And the smaller one is in front of the stove. Well, I don't know if I did it on purpose. Again, after a couple glasses of Chardonnay, who knows who cares? I got this one. So that's the pattern. Let me hold it upright. The black and red. Now, this one, the back, it has those felt tips that are kind of like grippers so that it doesn't slide. I have tile floors. Maybe you have hardwood. This, I believe, I'm going to put in front of the front door. Yeah, sounds good. Sounds good. I know my camera feels it's kind of like on the slant. I couldn't adjust the bracket. I was not messing with it. After this week, like I said, I'm trying to get through it. And this is a very healthy distraction because, let me tell you, training is an EMT and surgical assistant going back to the passenger that was convulsing, foaming at the mouth, flatlined in my arms. 
the man died in my arms. And uh, you would think our training as flight attendants or even me as a... I'm not answering him. Um, my medical training would have helped me... Shit, I dropped the price tag handle the situation better, but I didn't. Everybody's like, you did great. You're awesome. Passengers are filming. It's on social media. It's on the news. That was Shannon. She was great. Yeah, I don't know. Perfectionist. Just doubting myself. Anyway, I have to go behind me just to see what I paid for this. All over the place. Not quite with it. It's all right. Anyway, I have a coffee bar. In my kitchen. I like my coffee in the morning, espressos, whatever. This was $3.89. And if you guys have seen previous hauls, you can see how the house is set up. I've got my bar, coffee bar, whatever. $3.89. Again, for the holidays. I thought it was really cute. A lot of these products, as I get through it, you're going to see that... Um, Kind of worried, you know, like dollar store has some really cute like holiday decorations. I was like, I'm not gonna pay nine dollars for something I can get at the dollar store for like a dollar twenty-five. But the thickness, it's all about that. Nah, go away. It says coffee is my Valentine's. It is thicker, durable, and it will stand on a shelf. So that's gonna go next to my Keurig coffee machine. Happy with that. My fiance is calling me to check up on me. He went to talk. I didn't want to go. And he's probably going to be upset I'm not answering the phone. I don't want to. Next product, $4.91. Again, back to the dollar store stuff. Definitely feel like it was overpriced. I feel like I could have found this at the dollar store for $1.25. Some of them are hurting. This just is always in forever. And I will do another video. Because I have bookshelves that have kind of funky shelving that I will decorate just like behind me. See my china cabinet? My antique china cabinet. I'll put that there. I'll put some Cupid bows and it will be cute for the holidays. But yeah, not cute. I'm not mad at it. But I do feel like it's something that was overpriced. Oh shit. Of course. Sorry. I'm pulling out stuff I have no reconciliation of purchasing. I think they sent me some free products. Yes, I vape. Sorry. You guys can go ahead and scold me in the comments. I know it's bad for my health, but I need a lot more than a vape tonight. All right. Your next product is And another Valentine's Day decor, hugs and kisses. Uh, I really, if I had to put a price on this, I'd say maybe $2. It is a little thicker. It is sturdy. It'll stand up. It's not so much particle board, but knowing how my shelves lined, I was like, all right, it'll match. It'll work. It's cute. I'm not, not mad at it. Next product is just February 14th. It is like a license plate type material. It was $4.38. Basically, I'm not going to take it out of the packaging yet. It is just a license plate that I can hang up, display. It says February 14th. Next product was $2.49. Now, I'm going to tell you guys, greeting cards is one of my favorite, favorite things to haul with Timu. Um, I paid $13, $14 for greeting cards. The spend $2.49. Okay, it says there's no one I'd rather annoy for the rest of my life. Okay. the uh and then it is blank inside and of course i'll write a novel because that's how i roll and i'll be like oh you've put up with my crap 
me doing the Timo haul and ignoring your phone calls as they come through while I do my haul as I just did. So, hopefully, don't forget me. Um, another greeting card. This one was a dollar ninety-three. Let's see if I can get my trusty scissors, my Timo scissors out. And see what does it say? Oh no. Oh, it's cute. Okay. And it says, Am I going to be able to go? You're my favorite, my favorite pair of eyes to look into, my favorite way to spend in the afternoon, my favorite person to laugh with, favorite person to text, or text I receive on my phone, and I'll always. Be my favorite smile, Let's see, or my favorite everything. I got a blank inside. So, true story. I don't know what it is, how I picked up the habit, but for eight years with this man, when I would get mad at him, and I will be the first to acknowledge in my first marriage, I was mean, that fighting Irish Philadelphia in me. I'd be like, F you, blah, 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 blah. Now when I argue with Jay, I figured the best way to say uh, back off was, you're not my favorite right now. And he would get so upset. Oh, my God. Girls, guys, he'd get so upset. He'd be like, what do you mean I'm not your favorite? You're my everything. So I constantly remind him, yes, sir, you're my favorite. All right, next product. This was... $5.71. We're going to do a multiple. This is $3.51. I believe one is placemats. The other one is a table runner. So I have a bar with island. I guess you could say with some stool set up. I'm just going to take one out because uh, they might not be a match. It's a meshy lace. Just a little heart, and that is the table runner. So I'll throw that across the bar. And then I have the two placements, Ucky, right here. And I'll set that up, like, for the two bar stools across. Sorry. Next product. Again, this is not my normal haul. I know my mood is off. I'm just trying to get through it, you guys. Don't judge me. All right? Don't be here if you don't want to. This was $7.79. And they are throw pillow covers. So we have a L-shaped um, sofa set sectional. Lots of pillows. This one says, love you forever. Trying to make it neat as far as throwing on the floor. This one says, all you need is love. They're kind of like a burlap material. I don't know the dimensions. I probably could have looked at the bag before I threw it on the floor. Sorry. Uh, happy Valentine's Day. But, and last but not least, probably like, and I love you. It says, uh, oh, February 14th. So they're really cute. I like that they are very different. You got the red. We'll do it. Roll those out, little decor, little details. I guess, you know what, my friends? I'm going to get through this. As you can see, I wrote on here no clue what this is. So I don't remember ordering it. I did look up my receipt, and I couldn't find it. Again, I didn't take it fully out of the package. I don't know what it is. Guess we'll find out together. If I still have no clue after you see this video, let me know. Cause I don't know if it's a free gift. I think they're 
was two of them, but it's got these like little tabs, these little adhesive stickers. And, oh, they're lips. Oh, maybe. Okay. All right. They are stickers on the back. So it looks like the back might peel off, I believe. All right, all right. Maybe they're like window decals, hot lips, mash, right? And then they have, oh, they're cute. These little tabs, see, to put on the back and see like even the windows behind me. I could do that. Wait, sorry. Okay, all right. Cute, 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 cute. I do think I ordered these now that I took them out of the package. Somewhat took shit out of the package. Stuff out of the package. Sorry. This is me. This is how I handle trauma. I just kind of put it in the back of my mind and deal with it later. Next product, again, I could be off on the prices because there's two of them, okay? And they are just like XO, I believe they're towels, like hand towels. I think I got one for my bathroom and one for the kitchen. Uh, two piece, 848, this one was 311. Let's see. Yeah, stuff. all right. Um, this must be the bathroom towel. Yeah, it's got fuzzies. I need to kind of take them off, but I can do that off camera like that. So this is like microfiber material. XL. I think this one would be more for the bathroom. It is larger. And then the other one is probably just the two uh, kitchen dish towels, is my guess. But they're microfiber. Okay, so again, for me, it's decorative pieces. Kisses on one side. Okay, kisses on both sides. XOXO. This is the two-piece set. All right, so you got your kisses and your XO. XO, double-sided. Bathroom, kitchen, make it work. I am trying to be really fast because I know these hauls can take forever. Uh, next product, it says it's a blanket. It is like vacuum sealed. It was $9.48. And I'm thinking, okay, it's a throw blanket. I get the vacuum seal. Very thin. I'm going to tell you guys now. Very, very thin. You saw the rugs. Oh, shit. It's a blanket. Hmm. Maybe I should have paid attention to the description, but... Okay. I'll put it over my Lazy Boy recliner. I should say Jay's. That, that ain't no blanket, bro. Like, no way. That, that ain't covering shit. Extremely small. Cute, because it goes with my um, rugs. Definitely is a decorative piece. And it is just going over the lazy boy. <laughs> it's a joke. Yeah. All right. Nine, I see that was $9.48. Are you... Kidding me? Like, really? That is going back because there's no way. What are you covering with a blanket? That would not even swaddle a newborn. Get the out of here. All right. Yeah, not happening. Not on my watch. That's going back. It'd be a cute little, like, decorative piece, but $9.48. Nah. Next product, $3.98. Some more. Wall, shelf, Valentine's Day decor. I am making a mess. Don't care. Just love. 
Show me the love. If you like my channel, like and subscribe. Love. That'll hold up. Uh, dollar store quality. A little bit thicker, but yeah, nah. Eh. Here's the thing, like, with Jay, it's his birthday, and we had this plan, this trip planned for, like, six months. So I was working, like, overtime, putting all these hours so we could go somewhere. I got sick, and then... Obviously, with a passenger dying in my arms, like, I'm physically and emotionally sick. But um, we're still going to try to go somewhere tomorrow. I think we're going to try to go to Bora Bora or whatever, but not for, like, the four days. It's going to be a quick, quick trip. I just want to make him happy. So, do what I can. Where am I at for time? Oh, my God, I'm a half hour in already. I'm going to try to uh, still make it. Mm. Good for you guys. Uh, this was the, as you can see in my notes. All right. That was those metallic lips that had the stickers on the back. There's two of them. I think it was a free gift. I didn't find it um, on my receipt. This was $2.59. It's like a lotto ticket. So you know how you got the scratch offs? Scratch them. But I thought it was cute. It says 14 things I love about you. So then what you do is you take these little stickers and you put them here. And he'll wake up in 14 days is my plan prior to Valentine's Day. He'll scratch one. And it might say I love your smile. And the next one might say uh, I love how you're my best friend. But I thought it was just a fun little thing to do. Kind of added bonus with the Valentine's Day gifts. I'm sorry, my neighbors are pulling up next to me. $2.59. Just hopeless romantic. Next product, $3.07. I had to like double check. I didn't know what it was, but it looks like and it is a pillowcase cover, again, for another throw pillow. It says, never forget that I love you. Hug this pillow until you can hug me again. The material on this is amazing. Very velvety, very soft. But he doesn't love that I'm a flight attendant because I'm not home that much. And he likes to be with me because he loves me. But... uh. A lot of times we'll do our late night texts and he'll say, I'm just really missing you. I hate your job. I hate that you're not here. So I'm going to take a throw pillow. I'm going to put it on our California King, my six foot two Sasquatch husband and say, you know what? I want to be there, babe. Where's the pillow? Just squeeze it. Maybe spray a couple spritzes of my perfume on it so it'll smell like me. Is that weird? Probably. I don't give up. Anywho, next product was $2.99. Again, if you have been a follower of my channel, you'll know that I love anything wood. I love the wood. And I will put this and wrap it around like a bottle of wine. I love the wine. Or the vase or the base of something. They're just like these um, beads. You got your pink, red, white. Got your little tassel on the end. It just says love and a little pendant. Come on, girl. Hold it steady. Whatever. Uh, but just a little touch. Extra Valentine's Day. I'm going to pull out. These are so damn cute to me. They were $5.47. Sorry, $5.45 when I got them. But I did do the receipt refund. And um, they're just birdies. Valentine's Day birdies. Just little decor, oh my God. So far, I think I have the most. In this order, Christmas obviously is number one. Two is Easter. Three now is Valentine's Day. So when you you pull it up on Timu, it'll show you the pair together. 
And then when you go to pay for it, it'll say purchase together, purchase separate. Mm. 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 How much is Timo? It's so cheap, 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 cheap. But yeah, you got your dude in the top hat with his heart, giving his love, and you got the girl that's like been in love with him since second grade, and she's trying to be all curtsy. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Plain hard to get, right? Make him an apple pie. Let's go. But these are just like really cute. I well, to me, they're really cute. And they stand up all right. Let's see. Let's see, shall we? This shirt is a little tight, obviously, because he gets thrown off the uh, cinnamon roll by. We got you over here, bro. Dude's just chilling. We'll get you up here, girl. Throw you back a little bit. Can you see? Trust me. It's like the you had to be there better in person look. Love it. All right, next product. Four dollars. Oh, maybe I might have to be. Oh my god, he's calling me again. I can't. Um. So I am not real sure, like what the YouTube allows. So I'm just gonna show you what it says. People, this is. Oh my God, hold up. I, I don't know if it's gonna record our conversation, whatever. He wants to be a blessed, maybe be blessed, hold on. 